Hi guys, welcome to Book Nook. Today's story is We're Going on a Bear Hunt by Michael Rosen. This has been a requested story from my goddaughter and her family. So, even though it's so well known and I've been quite nervous about reading this story, I really hope you enjoy it. We're going on a bear hunt. We're going on a bear hunt by Michael Rosen and Helen Oxenbury. We're going on a bear hunt. We're going to catch a big one. What a beautiful day. We're not scared. Uh-oh, grass, long wavy grass. We can't go over it. We can't go under it. Oh no, we've got to go through it. Swishy, swashy, swishy, swashy, swishy, swashy. We're going on a bear hunt. We're going to catch a big one. What a beautiful day. We're not scared. Uh-oh, a river. A deep, cold river. We can't go over it. We can't go under it. Oh no, we've got to go through it. Splash, 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 splash. We're going on a bear hunt. We're going to catch a big one. What a beautiful day. We're not scared. Uh oh, mud, thick, oozy mud. We can't go over it. We can't go under it. Oh no, we've got to go through it. Squelch, squirch, squelch, squirch, squelch, squirch. We're going on a bear hunt. We're going to catch a big one. What a beautiful day. We're not scared. Uh-oh, a forest, a big dark forest. We can't go over it. We can't go under it. Oh no, we've got to go through it. Stumble, trip, stumble, trip, stumble, trip. We're going on a bear hunt. We're going to catch a big one. What a beautiful day. We're not scared. Uh-oh, a snowstorm, a swirling, whirling snowstorm. We can't go over it. We can't go under it. Oh no, we've got to go through it. Going on a bear hunt. We're going to catch a big one. What a beautiful day. We're not scared. Uh oh, a cave. A narrow, gloomy cave. We can't go over it. We can't go under it. Oh no, we've got to go through it. Tiptoe, what's that? One shiny wet nose, two big furry ears, two big goggly eyes. It's a bear! Quick! Back through the cave. Tiptoe, tiptoe, tiptoe. Back through the snowstorm. Back through the forest, stumble, trip, stumble, trip, stumble, trip. Back through the mud, squelch, squirch, squelch, squirch. Back through the river, splash, 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 splash. Back through the grass, swishy, swashy, swishy, swashy. Get to our front door, open the door, up the stairs. Oh no, we forgot to shut the door. Back downstairs, shut the door, back upstairs, into the bedroom, into bed. 
under the covers. We're not going on a bear hunt again. Okay, idea number one. Think about the repeated chorus of the story. We're going on a bear hunt. We're going to catch a big one. It's a chant. It's something that you say as you're marching along. So can you get some instruments? Can you have a go at tapping the beat as you hear the story? Idea number two. We can't go over it. We can't go under it. Oh no, we've got to go through it. How many things can you think of that you can't go over and you can't go under, but you've got to go through? Which part of the story is your favourite? Mine is the thick, oozy mud. How does it feel when they go through each part? I'd like you to go on a walk and talk about all the different things that you have to go through. What sounds can you hear? Go through the woods. Can you hear the crackle of the sticks and the leaves as you stand on them? Maybe walk through the town and you can hear the sound of the traffic and the sirens and the people. Idea number four. Think about the story at the end when they get back into bed. Do you think it really happened? Do you think they really saw a bear? Or do you think it was a dream? Hmm. Can you think of or create a crazy idea of a dream where you go on adventure and discover something and then you rush back home again? <laughs>